before this video begins, I'd like to shout out to XX Game Beast XX98 for joining me in Xbox Live on Fortnite. I've never played Fortnite before, but um, thank you for talking to me. It's always awesome to talk to subscribers. Anyway, may the f uh, I don't know may the conlet be with you. Cheers. Enjoy the video. There has been an awakening. Have you felt it? Hello guys, my name is iMac117 and today we are looking at the Honest trailer for the Avengers Infinity War movie. So, let's check this out. So, so shit, hold on, give me a bit. Three, two, one. Now. The following trailer is rated S for spoilers. Today's episode is brought to you by the U.S. Army. From the Thanos of Hollywood comes what could be the best movie Marvel's ever made, but without a doubt is the most movie Marvel's ever made. The most movie? What does he mean by that? Man, there is just so much movie in this movie. Look at all that movie. <laughs> what? Avengers Infinity War. <laughs> Look at all this movie. Journey into a new era of the MCU, where after 10 years of having to streamline their plot so normies would know what's happening, Marvel's gotten so big, they'll drop you right into episode 19, part one of two, without wasting a second on who anyone is or why you should care. Because let's face it, you're either on this hype train by now, or the Winter Soldier using Rocket Raccoon as a sidearm won't mean sh to you. Did you see? <laughs> They're both cyborgs rebelling against their destructive program to do Dad, why aren't you listening to me? Are you yawning? Uh, that's All your like favorite my heroes are sister. here, like Tony Stark, the scientist who finds out magic exists and takes it in stride. He came here to steal a necklace from a wizard. But literally can't even when another quippy guy with a goatee shows up. What is your job exactly besides making balloon animals? Star Lord, whose entire first movie was completely undone. We'd like to express our profound regret for your help in saving Xandar. He decimated Xandar. And takes it in stride, <laughs> but literally can't even when another buff guy with blonde hair shows up. Are you mocking me? He's trying to copy me. Just... Captain America, who heroically accepts his reduced role as guy who knows a guy. Can we do that? Not me, not here. I know someone. Yeah. Who could find vision then? I always found that Black disappointing. Panther, whose lack of screen time proves no one knew how big of a deal he'd be. And Spider-Man, the boy who'd rather hitch a ride into space and die than stay home and be in Venom. Like a bird in the wind. <laughs> you and me both, kid. Uh, they're not I love alone Venom. because oh, all these other characters it. are also back. Like Bruce Banner, a man in desperate need of a Phase 3 recap video. Tony, you've lost another super bot. Who's <laughs> Ant-Man. There's an Ant-Man. <laughs> Phase 3 super video. They just broke up. We're toast. Like a band? Like like the Beatles? Scarlet Witch, the X-Man who's completed her Halle Berry arc of losing her weird accent as the movies go on. Everybody's afraid of something. Well, there are people who are expecting me too, you know, we both made promises. Yeah, Gamora, I always found that weird. The emotional center of the whole story and the best actor? Huh, didn't see that one coming. Me neither. Loki, slightly more dead than the last two times. <laughs> the rest of the Guardians pre-James Gunn petition. Uh, those were simpler times a few weeks ago. And Bucky, the one-armed artisanal goat cheese farmer. Oh, yeah. But they're not alone either, because holy crap, there are so, so many people in this movie. Like Rhodey, Okoye, Mantis, Vision, Okoye. Falcon, Wong, Shuri, M'Baku, Red Skull, Nick Fury. Oh, hey, where you been? Thunderbolt <laughs> Ross? Again? Okay. Marissa Hall, right? Is Maria Hill. Pepper. Hey, last phase one girlfriend standing. Good for you. Nit Nedry? And Hawkeye. Sname. Where's Clint? Wow, the only heroes missing are the ones on all those Netflix shows Kevin Feige hates. Next time, really? Fist. Next time. Does Kevin Feige hate those shows? Or not. For all the characters I didn't know that. crammed Why into does the stage, thrill as it centers around a buff ball guy trying to grow his rock collection. No, Thanos. He's been looking for the Infinity Stone so long, he's changed color twice. And after he <laughs> vowed in Age of Ultron to do it himself. Yep. I'm doing myself. 
he waited like seven whole movies, including two that took place in space, and then boldly sent more of his kids to do it for him. You, sir, are a really bad stepfather. Yeah. Dang, what a great daddy. Oh, yeah, yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> Watch these movies catch up to one of comics' longest running traditions, briefly killing people off to goose sales. Where, with a single snap of the fingers, Disney erased the box office potential of Black Panther, <laughs> Spider Man, Five Sevens of the Guardians, Doctor Strange, <laughs> The Winter Soldier, and one third of the Avengers. And if you think these deaths are gonna stick for longer than a movie, I've got a copy of The Death of Superman to sell you. I mean, it's still in the original bag, mint condition, with the armband, too. Come on, no one? How about the death of Tony Stark? Death of Captain America? How about Thor? Nick Fury? Hawkeye? Okay, how about a copy of Infinity Gauntlet where the same thing happens and they all come back just fine? Cool? Cool. So cool. Scarring. Who throws a moon? Honestly. <laughs> Four Stooges. Beards of no nation. He was a one-eyed blonde Thor flying purple people beater. Under Armour. Dumbo. Portal Combat! <laughs> Too long. Thanks for nothing. Signed the Avengers. Pretty much. Forge, but he's awesome in the movie. A hologram for the king. Teen Titan Blow. It wasn't me. It was the one armed Stan. Do 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 My Gamora. Red <laughs> Dead Redemption. And the Dustus League. The Dustus League. Well, Game of Stones. <laughs> So, we're just gonna give him a pass for pretending this was a standalone movie? Yeah, yeah, we are. Today's episode. He doesn't was sound like he liked the movie. D does he not. Did he not sound like. Whoever was writing this, it sounded like the person just didn't like this film. I is that just me? Like, every time he mentioned something. It just said like, oh, this movie. I don't know. Is that just me, or am I just going insane? I just feel like it didn't sound like he really liked it. But um, yeah, I actually got the Infinity Gauntlet comic. I've read it. It is so awesome. I kind of think I know what could possibly happen in the next thing, but it, it really relies on what they can do. Like, I don't know if they have Galactus and shit, but um, yeah, it's really fucking cool. Um. I'm I'm so annoyed that they got rid of James Gunn for Guns 3. I think it's a little bit unfair because, I mean, I know the stuff he wrote was really fucked up and bad, but it was like 10 years ago, you know, and people change over time. And I think that's the problem with today's society. People just don't think people change. I mean, you know, look at Robert Downey Jr. Wasn't he like a drugger or some shit before he became Iron Man? And now he's Iron Man and he's like one of the greatest actors in the world, you know, like one of the best characters as well. So, I think it's a load of shit that they got rid of. I didn't know Kevin Feige didn't like, um, uh, the Defenders and the Netflix show. Is that true? Or is that, is that just, is he just making that up? Because I didn't think that was true. Hmm. He must just not like them. Maybe he just doesn't like the direction they put them in or something. I personally really like the shows. I like Luke Cage. No, we'll do it with the same. I like I like Luke Cage. I like Luke, uh, Daredevil. I like Punisher. Defenders is alright. And I hate Jessica Jones and Iron Fist. I haven't actually watched Iron Fist, but I'm not going to. Because I cannot be bothered watching that. Um, anyway, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao.